It's Shalawan, Shalawan. It's Shalak, y'all. This phone, you know, it cut off sometimes when it want to, but I was in the middle of a lesson going into this article, man, right? And how all these things that they put on me the, the media, social media, all these things are distractions to keep you distracted from the, 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 the true your true purpose, right? Which our true purpose is to do what? To serve the Heavenly Father, Yahweh Shem Yahweh with fear and trembling. So this is all a distraction, man. That's all it is to keep our minds, all right, uh, 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 you know, away from the heavenly Father, man. So I gotta, I'm gonna just look the word distraction up real quick, which I got it right here. It says distraction, a thing that prevents someone from giving full attention to something else, diversion, interruption, disturbance, right, diversion, something intended, right. These things are intended to distract you from the from what matters most, man. Which are the prophecies of the Heavenly Father. That's what matters most. Something intended to distract someone's attention from something more important, right? Because you got more important things going on out here in the world like this inflation. We were talking, me and the brother, we did a lesson about it. But that's more important than the trial for the for the, for the the insurrection on January the 6th, man. Inflation. The, house, the, the, the cost of living is going up. The value of the dollar is going down. They talking about this UBI, this universal basic income, right? The CBDC. These things are more important than than a than a, a trial for individuals who who stormed the capital, man, right? Um. So let me get this uh precept real quick. So it's Baruch four and and twenty eight. For as it was your mind to go astray from the heavenly Father, so being returned, seek him ten times more. So we're supposed to be seeking the heavenly Father more and more as the days, as the day of the heavenly Father draws nigh. Man, we're supposed to be seeking the heavenly Father. Let me go back to these words. You know, so it says I'm gonna read the version again because that was a good a good word. It says something intended to distract someone's attention from something more important, man. Right? Which is what is more important? The prophecies that's found in the Holy Scripture. That's more important than the insurrection on January the sixth at 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 at, at Capitol Hill, whatever wherever that place in Washington D.C., man. Right? Full definition. <laughs> An instance of turning something aside from its course. That's right, man. Right? That's what these things are intended to do, to turn us aside from our course. And what is our course, man? All right? You Negroes, Latinos, neighbors, Seminole, Indians, we're supposed to be walking in the path of righteousness to the best of our ability. Right? Because we're getting closer and closer to the day of judgment of the Heavenly Father. Right? So that's that. That's that's a beautiful... Um, I'm going I'm to read that one again, this one. Right, um, Salaki. Ah, damn. <sighs> right, so a diversion. Salaki. Something intended to distract someone's attention from something more important. Right, and what is important that's going on out here? Right, it's a war. Hey, well, well, that's that's also to distract you too. Anything that they put on the media, if it's not pertaining to the 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 the, the, the prophets, man. See, that's what's most important, man. Right. You know, following the prophets of the Heavenly Father, being followers of the prophets of Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai. That's what's more important, right? Your life is more important than than a than a than a, a trial, right? It was something that I wanted to say from reading on um, one of these definitions. Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai, come back to me, man. An instance of turning something aside from its course, right? Rerouting, redirection. Turning aside, con. The scriptures speak about turning aside, and that's why these devils have all these these illusions. It's all go. It all go back to witchcraft and sorcery. That's all it is. It's all because they trying to put spells and enchantments upon Jacob. But the heavenly Father said there is no enchantment against Jacob. Roughly paraphrasing. So all these this sorcery and this witchcraft that these devils are indulging in, they doing that because their intention is to turn aside to deviate us from the course, man. To deflect us, it says. Um, it says uh, an alternate route for use by traffic when and that's pertaining to something else. It's an activity that diverts the mind from tedious or serious concerns. That's right, man. So all these distractions, social media, that's in this, that's a distraction. That's an activity that diverts the mind from tedious or serious concern. Right? It's serious concern. Right? Jacob's trouble is drawing nigh, man. 
the time of Jacob's trouble is about to be martial law here. It's a famine coming, right? These things are more tedious and, 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 and more serious, man. A recreation or pastime, and that was a good definition, number two, an activity that diverts the mind from tedious or serious concerns, right? It's just like uh, uh, with, with the bread and circus, man. You know, you just had the All-Star Weekend, and then the week before that, you had the Super Bowl. So these things are, oh, it says that, entertainment, entertainment. And that's the spirit because... When you go into the word fun, the elder Apostle Gabar, he was going into it and breaking down what the word fun goes back to the Latin word, uh, 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 divert the mente. So that's all this fun is intended to do, to divert you from your from your course of action, right? Amusement. We ain't that we ain't in a time of being amused right now. We shouldn't be we're in a time of putting up supplications. We're in a time of mourning and weeping. All right? Asking mercy of the Heavenly Father. It says, um, uh -uh. relaxation pleasure right we, we of course we ain't supposed to be, we ain't in a time of pleasure man the scripture talk about you know it's a time of place for everything um let's read this one something intended to distract someone's attention from something more important and what's more important the prophecies of the heavenly father that's more important than anything that could be going on in you Negroes, Latinos, Native Asino Indians lives, man. You Israelite lives. The prophecies of the Heavenly Father, that's more important, man. Right? Because the Heavenly Father is, is angry. <laughs> right? So we're supposed to be trying to appease and satiate the Heavenly Father to the best of our ability. We're supposed to be trying to satisfy the Heavenly Father and pacify, if you will, for lack of a better term, the Heavenly Father. Right? And how do we do that? You know, by following the law, statute, commandments to the best of our ability, man. Right? Smoke screen, con. This is, this is all. This is all. Let me look that up, man. It said a cloud of smoke created to conceal military operations. That's the spirit, man. So they got all these, these, these uh smoke screens, right? You know, to conceal their 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 true intents, man. All these things are smoke screens that this devil is putting out before your eyes because our people people look at the carnal things they don't look at the uh, spiritual things man you know but yeah i'm gonna just you know i'm kind of in the middle of something i just wanted to continue on this lesson but you know lord willing how about you i was edifying i'm gonna read some uh, more of this article real quick um it says uh washington the first january the first january 6th Defendant to take his case to trial was found guilty Tuesday of all charges related to his role in the attack on the U.S. Capitol. <laughs> Guy Refit, a Texas man who tried to storm the U.S. Capitol while armed with a gun and, and zip ties, was convicted of all five counts, including transport of a firearm in support of civil disorder and obstruction of an official proceeding. The jury met by barely two hours before it informed the judge that it had reached a verdict, man. You know, so this is all just a distraction. This is all just a smoke screen. You know, we got to be able to we got to be able to see through these things. Right. We got to be looking with our spiritual eye to the best of our ability, man. That's what we got to be doing. OK. Hey, so with that, I want to give all glory on the praise of call. Law, you like how about Hashem, you have a shy. Well, I'm a shock of dust. The minus the past is a great millstone. Rule. Shalom. Makasala. Bakiyam. Waflaba ball.